reminiscing on the life of Gabriel Strondolo, also known as Gabo of Larry Shoes, who passed away on March 18, 2011, and was laid to rest on March 28, 2011. You were a loving husband, father, grandfather, cousin, uncle, brother, nephew, and friend. The qualities and attributes you possessed made you a precious pool in the chain of our lives, Mr. Dolo. D is for decisive, able to make quick decisions. O, optimistic, always had a solution to make a difficult situation have a more hopeful view. L, listener, to time to listen, to friends and family, to share a word of advice and encouragement. O, outspoken, always said exactly how he felt. R, for responsible, always did his best and worked against all odds, someone you could rely on. You were remembered on your 60th birthday, which was on February 27, 2013, a day you always made the best of. It is a pity you were not here to celebrate. You brought joy to those who loved you and a smile to everyone you met. Your life is a gift that will always be treasured. Your birthday is just another day in the year. It is a special time to celebrate your life and your heart. Two years have passed and we still mourn your loss. Death of a loved one is always hard to deal with, but it is a destined end of our moral existence. Gabriel, many nights I stay up in the pitch dark of the night, thinking of you especially on occasions like birthdays, Christmas, our wedding anniversary, cause you always went an extra mile to make those days memorable. I thank God for the day I met you and when you looked into my eyes and said you loved me, a love so true and treasured that it is what kept the flame burning. Every morning I woke up and would have found the most handsome man lying beside me. Gabriel, you were a blessing sent from above. You were a dedicated father and grandfather. You meant the world to us. Only a heart like yours would have been so self-sacrificing. The profuse things you did, all the times you were there aid us to know deep inside how much you cherished us. We value all you ever did. We were blessed to have a man like you to call our dear father. Dad, you are gone but not forgotten. As it dawns another year, in lonely hours of thinking thoughts of you are always near. Many think that the wound is healed, but little do they know of the sorrow that lies in our hearts concealed. You were also an affectionate friend cousin, brother, uncle, and nephew, who constantly made time to share a helping hand. Your life, earnest, your action, kind. You always had a word or thought that brought a smile on our faces when your days seemed so melancholy. You are not forgotten, though on earth you are no more. Still in memory you are with us as you always will be for, always in our hearts, forever with the Lord, rest in perfect peace. Words provided by his wife and family.